G'day ladies and gentlemen and welcome back to another Grand Theft Auto 5 Online Money Method video. In this video today, I'm going to show you multiple ways to make millions of dollars in the game this week as a solo player. Of course, leaving a like and subscribing is greatly appreciated. And without further ado, let's go. All right, so for the first money method, you're going to want to come to Legion Square where you can see the Rockstar Featured Series icon. It's going to be a pink circle and all you'll want to do is just make your way into that circle press left d-pad and go on call for the job otherwise another way you can find this adversary mode series this week is go to the pause menu head to online go to jobs play job rockstar created adversary mode and scroll down till you see the adversary mode series called hunting pack remix there's going to be seven different jobs in total and you can start up anyone you would like and now if you are the host of this job then i would highly recommend that you do set the first to win setting to five rounds as that is going to be the maximum amount that you can set trust me these do go by really quickly unless you are in it for the long haul sometimes i've found these missions do go by really quickly as the opposing team can really just take out the runner as soon as possible but we'll get into the premise of this mission so basically you have a runner in this case it's going to be the brocade and you're pretty much trying to carry as much speed as possible there'll be a meter in the bottom right hand corner and you have the attackers and the defenders now if you're on the defending team you are trying to stop the attacking team from bringing that runner to a halt as you can see here the runners our team currently in this one here with the scramjets have brought the runner to a halt and this was a round where i am the runner itself you're trying to make your way to the deactivation zone without coming to a halt. As long as that speed meter is above that black line, then the bomb won't activate. This makes for some incredibly fun gameplay, as you can see here. It was almost at the finish line here or in the deactivation zone where I almost lost it, but you can see this is a different game mode here, so a different hunting pack mix. And when it comes to the payout this week, it's paying double money and RP. So this was for a round of seven players. We went through the rounds relatively quickly, made a pretty decent payout, but if you guys do make these rounds a lot longer you'll be able to make up to over one hundred thousand dollars all right so money method number two this week in gta 5 online is your regular time trial end to end with a part time of four minutes and nine seconds just press right d-pad when you're within the vicinity of the starting area go to your map and set a waypoint to the end destination this week we have got a mega time trial it's going to be about seven miles you'll need to travel and that's the premise of the title of this time trial end to end so once you've set the waypoint to the end destination just back out of your map bring up your phone head to the job list and quit the job so what we've basically done there is just set a waypoint to the end destination as typically when you start up a regular time trial there is not going to be a waypoint set for you so a few hot tips for you when completing this week's weekly time trial just make sure you're pulling back on your left analog stick to perform a wheelie as much as possible the other thing i would recommend is to keep an eye out for traffic you can see here just how sketchy it can get before you get onto this main los santos highway and with the motorcycle of your choice just be sure to try and upgrade your engine level as much as possible as this time trial is going to be a balance between just one staying on the bike and two raw speed so if you incorporate all of those tips into this regular time trial this week you'll guaranteed be able to complete it with plenty of time left it's quite deceiving at first because when you start up this time trial you'll see seven miles you'll need to travel in four minutes and you'll just think it's not possible but it really is just quite a cruisy ride through los santos and before you know it you'll cross the finish line with a payout of 104k so moving on to your third money method for this week just a quick one if you are a ceo bodyguard or associate for a ceo or motorcycle club president this week it's paying triple money so it doesn't seem like a lot of money well it's not a big amount of money like millions of dollars but you can make thirty thousand dollars every 10 minutes equating to one hundred eighty thousand dollars an hour which isn't too shabby at all as long as you keep that ceo or president alive the payout will still remain at thirty thousand dollars every 10 minutes however if they are taken out the payout will decrease so if you receive an invite this week to become a bodyguard or an associate for a ceo why not take it and your fourth money method for this week in gta 5 online is this week's hsw time trial terminal with a part time of four minutes and 15 seconds this can seem quite deceiving at first and we'll get into that just shortly so first of all press right d-pad and start the time trial then go to your map and set a waypoint to the end destination as you can see we may need to travel through the dirt trail around mount 
up Chiliad, but we're not quite just going to be doing that as I'm going to show you an alternative route which you'll complete with plenty of time left. Six and a half miles in four minutes, 15 minutes seems quite unattainable. So let's show you a route that's going to make you complete this with ease, no stress, and you'll make a good amount of money by the end of it. So first of all, just get out of the docks there. Then before the Los Santos customs, just take a left to get on this highway. Just keep following this straight along. Eventually take a sweeping right hander here, follow straight along eventually till you get to this part here and just tuck to the left. Soon as you get that section of the time trial out of the way and you're on your way through the tunnel here, just keep following straight along this highway along the coast. Of course, being careful of traffic along the way and you'll complete this with ease. One minute left and make 250k. Your fifth money method for this week has got to be your most wanted and standard bounties for the bail office. This week it's paying double money and RP on regular and most wanted bounties. So it's a perfect time to make millions of dollars through this business. So all you'll want to do is one, of course, be sure to have a bail office. Now, unfortunately this week, as we've been having a good run with businesses, typically there would be a business discount, but for the bail offices, there is not unfortunately. So what I would recommend is you can pick one up for as cheap as $2.1 million. I've got a full money guide on my channel for the bail office business I released yesterday. But for the time being, I would stick with a bail office location in the city or the heart of Los Santos. I would say steer clear of the one in Polito Bay. However, some missions do spawn out there, not the most wanted bounty ones, but the standard bounties. So if you're looking to save maybe half a million dollars, you could opt to go out there. It's just going to be a little bit more difficult when it comes to those high value bounties. So within your bail office, if you take a seat in your office chair and access the desktop or the bail enforcement system, you can log in. You'll see there are three blue bounties and one red. The three blue bounties are standard or regular bounties. They're paying double money this week. And your red bounty is going to be your high value most wanted bounty. So for reference, those blue bounties will cycle through every hour IRL and the red high value most wanted bounty will cycle through every 24 hours. So for your standard bounties, there are up to 18 different targets that you could potentially get and the payouts will vary anywhere between 60 to $100,000 for these. There will also be up to six different mission types that you could get for these. And when it comes to your high value most wanted bounties, the payouts for these this week will vary anywhere between 240 to 260 thousand dollars and so for your high value most wanted bounty targets there are up to six different targets that you could potentially get they all have different missions and some come with an additional reward or sort of loot bag which is typically a 5k bonus but this week it'll be 10k so say you get a target this week and you're not too quite sure how to complete it i've got a full guide that i released yesterday for every bounty target and you'll be able to easily complete it over there and also your weekly challenge for this week is secure six bail office bounties and you'll be rewarded with an additional $100,000 payout. Well, ladies and gentlemen, a pretty good week for making some money in GTA 5 Online, especially as a solo player. I really do hope this guy did help you guys out. If it did, be sure to share it with a friend, leave a like, subscribe for more. But in the meantime, take care and I'll see you in my next video.